In this video, I'll show you five options using which you will be able to generate stunning AI images and that too absolutely for free. Please stick to the end of the video to know one tool which you may not have used earlier, which came in market recently with multiple different good options. So instead of wasting any time, let's get into the video right now. So currently you can see I'm in Google homepage and the first option I will show you that is Mistral AI. Mistral AI is a French LLM model which is available completely for free. I earlier published one video covering features of Mistral AI, but today I'll show you how can you generate images that took completely for free using Mistral AI. So if I now just paste one prompt here, this is generate an image of two golden retrievers playing together. Now what we are going to do today, all these tools I'm going to talk about, I'll use one single prompt so that we'll be able to understand which tool is doing better in certain scenarios. So after I pasted the prompt, if I click on image generation and then I click on this particular button, it will start generating the image for us. So currently you can see it's working and now the image has been generated. And look at this quality of this image. If I just download this image and let's see, this is downloaded and look how sharp these images are. So this is an excellent tool using which you will be able to generate free images that too with this type of quality. This was the first option. Now let me show you the second option and that is meta.ai. Now Meta AI is available for all of us. If you are using WhatsApp on your mobile, Meta is available there and using that feature also, you'll be able to generate images whenever you are on the go. I earlier again published a couple of videos related to Meta AI. I will add those links in the description below so that you can also check it out. Now, similar prompt I will type here, generate an image of a golden retriever playing together. But for Meta.ai, it's better that you start your prompt with slash imagine. And then if you hit this particular button, then it will start generating that image for you. Normally it generates four different versions of the image using one single prompt so that you will be able to choose from those four which one you like the most and which one you want to use. Now you can see it generated these four images and look at this thing. If I just click on that and again, I'll be able to download from this icon and then you'll be able to double click on that particular image and you'll be able to see the quality of this image. At the end, I will show you all these images as a comparison. So what I'll do, I'll close it for now. Another very good feature here, if you click on animate, now this image will get animated and this is an additional feature available with Meta AI. And just think about all these things are available for free. You don't need to spend a penny to get this kind of features. Look at this thing, how it's generated. And also you'll be able to download this particular video as an MP4 file if you click on download. You can see it just downloaded as an MP4 file. So this was our option number two. Now, before I show you the next option, one small announcement, I'm in process to record one generative AI course, chat GPT, Google Gemini, Microsoft Copilot, Claude, everything will get covered there. I have added one link in the description below. Please fill that form if you want to get a discount coupon once the course will be live. Now, let me show you the next option. Now, option number three is you may not used it earlier, but let me show you what I'm talking about. If you go to Twitter, now current name is X. So if I click on this uh, twitter.com or x.com, whatever way you want to access, and then it will open your Twitter feed. If you don't have an account in Twitter, you can create it, and then you will be able to use this particular feature. There is one option in the left pane that is Grok. If you click on that, then a new pane will open and there you will be able to generate images. Now, Grok is a full fledged LLA model similar to ChatGPT. You will be able to use it. One video is coming in this channel completely covering this particular feature. So please do subscribe to my channel if you want to watch that video too. Now, here also again, I'll paste that particular prompt and it is going to generate our images. Now, if I click on this particular button, it will start generating the image for us. And again, it will show you four different options. And from there, you can choose. Now you can see it's showing the progress while it is generating those images. And these images are, are being generated now. And now if I click on any of them, you can see again, an excellent quality image. And from these three dots, you will be again able to download these images. So these are excellent options. You can see the quality of the image of whatever you are getting, the speed and quality of the image you are getting for all this for free and that's phenomenal and it was not available maybe some few years back also right so these are the tools you will be able to use 
So this was our third option. Now next one is Microsoft Copilot. Now you can use this particular option using both ways. One using your Copilot account. If you have a Microsoft account and you have logged into the Copilot earlier, there you will be able to generate your images. You can also access the same feature from Bing search. If you go to a new tab and there you just type Bing AI, then you will be able to find that particular option free AI image generator and there also you will be able to prompt and you will be able to generate. So let me show you the both options. If I paste my prompt here and I click on generate, then it will start generating the image. I have already logged in using my ID. If you have not logged into Bing earlier, you can do it. Now you can see it generated an image within a cartoon style. Now if I come here and in the copilot and if I just paste the same prompt again, and then I click on this option, then it will generate the image here also. If you want to generate a different type of image that you can mention in the, your prompt, considering this one only generated a cartoon style, if you want to avoid that and you always want a realistic style photo that you can mention. But currently what we are doing, we're just testing out these tools very simply using a very simple prompt with some seven, eight words only. So this is a very simple prompt. So we are not giving any major details in there. All the tools are generating as per their own way, but down the line, as per your requirement, you can fine tune it a bit. So now if I just click on this particular button again, it will get downloaded and then you can see the quality of the image, what it generated. And again, another good image with a different style actually. Now let me show you the next option. So while Copilot and Bing Chat, whenever we're using, it is actually using OpenAI DALI model in the backend. So both tools can give you similar type of output based on your prompts. Now let me show you one option which came to market recently and that is a product of Alibaba. If you have not used their tool, you can just paste this particular link that is chat.quinlm.ai. Now this is Alibaba's product which becoming a competitor of OpenAI, Microsoft or Google you can use this particular tool to generate good amount of images. Now, this is the interface you'll see that once you will be able to log in inside Quinn. If you don't have any ID, you can use your Google credentials to log in. I'm also in process to record a full video using Alibaba Quinn and there I'll talk about each and every options inside it. But in this video, let's talk about that image only. Again, if I paste my prompt and then I click on image generation, there you'll be able to see there's one very good option that you will be able to choose your aspect ratio of your image. If you are looking for a vertical form or horizontal form, or 16 is to 9 or 4 is to 3, that you will be able to do. I'll click on 16 is to 9 for now. Now it is also showing you few different options also and there once you mouse over you will be able to use their prompt to generate your own version of the image. So you can play with this particular feature and then you will be able to see some excellent images. But for now if I hit this particular button then it will start generating that image for us based on our prompt. Now you can see it generated the image and here also you will be able to download using this particular button and then you can see this image output is 1.6 MB. So this is a bit higher resolution than other tools whatever it was generating. Now you can see the quality and the resolution of this particular image also. Now let me show you the sixth and this is the bonus option. We already covered five that is Mistral AI, Meta AI, then Grok then Microsoft Copilot and Bing together. And the fifth one was Alibaba's Coin. And now let me show you one final option and that also generates an excellent quality images. And I'm showing you this particular tool as a bonus. If you open a new tab and there you just type Adobe Firefly and then you will be able to see some of the options. If I click on this first one, it will take me to the Adobe website. So this is the first page you will be able to see. You just need to come here and there is one option text to image and if you click on create with firefly then you will be able to see this particular interface where multiple different stunning images are already there which have been already created by other users now in the below there is one option that is the prompt and there you will be able to type your prompt 
now for adobe there are some credit system monthly basis they give some credit using which you will be able to generate images so it is for free till the time you have available credits if you click on your profile picture you will be able to see i have 24 credits left out of 25 they allocate on monthly basis so let me show you how this is generating the image if i click on generate then it will start working on my request so again you can see this generate an excellent quality image and if you click on here and then there are some of the tips it is showing i'll click on that and you will be able to click on upscale to upscale that image but it will cost you some credits but if i just download this particular option and then my image will get downloaded now you will be able to see this particular image so these are the six options using which you will be able to generate stunning ai images and that too absolutely for free i earlier also published another video using which you will be able to generate stunning ai images and that too again completely for free with multiple different customization options. Check out this video if you want to know everything about it.